As much as we all hate the free-to-play model, we all like it a clash of clans. It's a fun game, great to play in small doses, and is full of logic weirdness. And that's why GameRanks brings you 10 Clash of Clans game concepts that make no sense. Number 10. When your town is under attack. It doesn't matter where the town hall is. It doesn't matter how vulnerable the town hall is. It seems to just matter that it's the town hall. And everybody thinks that's a good place to hide. So all the citizens hide in it. That thing could be the only thing on your map, have no walls around it, it doesn't matter, that's where everybody goes. Not out to the forest, where an attack is not happening. Nope. Town Hall. Help! Our Town Hall is being destroyed! The citizens screamed as they ran to hide in the Town Hall. Number 9. You raise an army to go attack other villages, and they give it their all when you do. A warrior's death! But defending it, eh, I don't know, I could probably just stay at camp. These grilled carrots are just too good, I am staying here. I mean, when you're the only restaurant in town and the only thing you serve is carrots, you better be damn good at it. And frankly, they are. Those carrots are delicious. And I, I, I'm, I'm just staying right here while everything else burns. And you know, just to be completely honest with you, I don't care if everything else burns as long as they continue to grill carrots here. Number 8. Speaking of that grilled carrot, when you upgraded your camp to level 3, it took 3 hours to add the carrot to your camp. That's, that's, that's it. That's, that's all there is. That's the difference. Look at the art. I mean, aside from the fact that it can hold more people, which I guess that carrot is so tantalizing, five extra warriors can hang around. You hear they're making grilled carrots at camp? <gasps> Holy shit, let's go! I gotta warn you, it's a little cramped down there. You said grilled carrots, I said I'm in. Number seven, when it comes time to upgrade that elixir tank or that dark elixir tank, that little genius contractor of yours hits it with a hammer. What do you think I'm paying you for? That's not gonna make it bigger. That's gonna make it brokener. Which I know is not a word, but just being grammatically wrong is much less dumb than hitting a glass container with a hammer to upgrade it. That requires you not to use your brain at all. Hey, I bought a brand new sports car, but I bought the base model, and I think I want to upgrade, so I'm just gonna go outside and smack my brand new sports car with a hammer for three hours. Number six, do you know what else builders hit with a hammer? Bushes. Look, I don't have a yard to landscape, and if I did, I wouldn't have money to hire a landscaper. But despite that lack of experience, I know the improper way to go about it is a hammer. Everyone knows that the right way to take a bush down is a shoe or one of these things. Yeah, people use these things all the time to clear down bushes. Hammers though, never see it. And that means any kind of hammer, including MC Hammer. They just don't take bushes down well. Number 5. There's no earthly way of knowing which direction the wind's blowing. Are the fires of hell are glowing? Is the grizzly reaper mowing? Yes, the danger must be growing, for the rowers keep on rowing. <laughs> I should stop there. Number four, when the AI of your attacking army decides that the important thing to attack, especially after everyone else is dead and, well, there's no hope, is a wall. I mean, that that's definitely the thing that I would do. I couldn't just do my best to find an undefended gold mine or something easy to get rid of and go do that. I have to attack the wall. Yeah, I could do something that came off as possibly useful. I could do something that we walked away from this whole thing with something. Nah, I'll attack the wall. To be fair, that wall sucks. I don't like that wall. Yeah. Number three, kind of like adding a carrot to the army camp in three hours. When your builder, or as I like to call them, general contractor, I think you've already figured out that's what I like to call them though, spends five days hitting the fireworks and then, you know, puts another firework into the barrel, I guess. I mean, that is the definition of a general contractor, not doing his job and charging you for it. That is time not worked that you are on the hook for. Look, dude, I need you working on something productive for five days, not hitting something and then putting another firework in it. This is why contractors have a bad name. You are contributing to a stereotype, sir. Number two. Okay, let's have a look at the level eight air defense versus the level eight mortar. Air defense, made of wood. Mortar, made of refined metal. Hit points, 
air defense wins, having like 600 more hit points than the refined metal structure. It takes two more days to build the fucking thing. Like I have to figure that level eight mortar is the shoddiest thing ever built or something. And these are in fact like wood craftsmen doing the job. But I also have to figure like the mortar looks decent so they kind of know what they're doing, but they rush through it. I don't know, I, I, I don't know. All I know is that the statistics I'm looking at don't make sense. Good job, contractors. You know how many points on this list I've had to take you guys down a peg? Just get better at your jobs already, okay? And finally, number one. The representation of how much gold I have is just ridiculous. Now, I'm not saying I need a Lambo out front or anything, but there is one coin in there. I've got like 40,000 gold, and this is what it looks like. Now, I'm not saying I need everybody to be going, oh man, look at how much money this guy has. And a big reason for that is that it's virtual money, and really, who cares? But like, I mean, there's gotta be some degree of satisfaction here. I worked really hard to do this. I didn't even spend any real money. Could you let me enjoy the fact that I've got some cash, Ola? So have you noticed any weird stuff in Clash of Clans? Or you know, you agree with one of these things and how weird it is. Or you're some kind of weird fan of grilled carrots and want to get in on that phenom. Leave us a comment. Tell us everything. Everything! Don't forget to click like because it does help us a great deal. Also, if you're not, make sure you subscribe to Game Ranks because we upload new videos every single day and the absolute best way to see them first is a subscription. We thank you so much for watching this video and as always we will see you next time here on Game Ranks.